Our planet consists of 70% water. Today, about 95% of the water expanses remain poorly explored or unexplored at all. The bulk of all creatures living in the seas and oceans live no more than 50 meters deep. The world's oceans are home to many amazing creatures that feel great at great depths. They are not bothered by high pressure or pitch darkness or lack of food or just a cold environment. The features of deep sea creatures are determined by their habitat conditions. The most basic difference is their simplified organization, flat body and long limbs. Here you can find echinoderms, mollusks, crustaceans and planktonic organisms. Let's get acquainted with the most incredible deep sea inhabitants. The deepest sea fish was discovered in 2014 at the bottom of the Mariana Trench and is called Pseudoliparis swiri or Mariana snailfish. This deep sea creature is a predator and has been recorded at a depth of 8,200 meters. Its length is about 10 centimeters. Blobfish This deep sea dweller is very different from ordinary fish and looks like an alien or a monster from sci fi movies. The size of the blobfish is no more than 30 centimeters. It lives at the bottom of the ocean near Tasmania and Australia. This fish has a spur on the front that closely resembles a human nose with eyes on each side. This fish has practically no muscles and resembles a slug. Its lifestyle is very similar to that of the sloth. The blobfish swims slowly, hoping that small prey will fall into its open mouth by themselves. Meanwhile, this creature doesn't have to worry about its safety. The blobfish is completely inedible. Nevertheless, it remains on the verge of extinction. The shark from the anime In 2018, American scientists discovered a new species of deep-sea shark named Squalus clarkae. This fish has vast and amazing eyes that resemble an alien or cartoon character. The shark is named after Eugenie Clark, a marine biologist who was the first woman to study sharks. This shark lives in the western Atlantic and the Gulf of Mexico. Its length is about 70 centimeters. All 20 species of squalus sharks need to be protected and studied. Japanese Spider Crab These creatures live off the coast of Japan. They can be found at depths of 50 to 300 meters. The Japanese spider crab can weigh up to 40 kilograms. The crabs look very fantastic and frightening because the span of their legs is about 3 meters and can reach up to 3.7 meters. Another impressive thing is that according to scientists, these amazing creatures can live up to 100 years. Pinnate Batfish This deep-sea dweller is very far from ordinary fish in its appearance. It doesn't look like them at all and can't even swim. Nevertheless, the pinnate batfish is a fish that moves on the bottom thanks to its fins, very similar to legs. This fish lives in the warm waters of the world's oceans at great depths. The largest specimens can reach up to half a meter in length. The pinnate batfish is a predator that lures small fish because of the bulb in its head, which has a special smell. Fish, crustaceans and worms swim to this smell, and the pinnate batfish sits in ambush. When the prey is close, the batfish grabs it. Frilled Relict Shark This shark lives at a depth of 1,500 meters and therefore is practically never encountered by people. Only in 2007, such a shark was found in shallow water and died after a couple of hours of transportation. The length of such an individual was 160 centimeters. Scientists have revealed similarities with extinct ancestors of the time of the dinosaurs. Wolffish This fantastic fish belongs to the family Anarchishatidae. The wolffish lives a depth of up to 500 meters in rocky terrain. A special feature of this creature is that it can stretch up to 1.5 meters in length. These predators have strong teeth that help them crush clams, sea urchins and crabs. The wolffish has many names such as devilfish, sea wolf, wolf eel, ocean catfish, and sea cat. Giant Isopod This crustacean creature can be found at the bottom of the Indian, Pacific, and Atlantic Oceans at depths from 170 to 2,000 meters. This giant isopod feeds on carrion such as dead fish, whales, and squid. Roundworms, sea cucumbers, and sponges can be food for isopods, but they can also attack predators larger than themselves. Giant isopods are the largest crustaceans. 
Their size is explained by low temperatures when the body cells increase in size and their lifespan increases. These creatures grow their entire lives, reaching a length of up to 36 centimeters. The largest isopod that was caught weighed 1.7 kilograms and reached 76 centimeters in length. Micropena microstoma It is a deep-sea fish with a unique anatomical and rather fragile structure. The fish has a soft transparent head and a barrel-shaped eyes and sensory organs that can extend and rotate. Pacific Hagfish This creature lives in the Pacific Ocean at depths of up to 1 km. In case of danger, the hagfish is capable of secreting huge amounts of mucus. The hagfish are scavengers. They can often be seen on the body of a dead creature. It is thanks to them the sea bottom has not turned into a garbage dump. These sanitarians clean the bottom from the corpses of dead animals. Ocean Sunfish This fish is the heaviest and is listed in the Guinness Book of Records with a weight of 2,235 kg, length of 3.1 meters and height of 4.26 meters. This fish lives at depths of up to 850 meters and is not dangerous to humans despite its huge size. Bathysaurus ferox This creature lives at depths of 600 to 3,500 meters and is classified as a deep-sea lizard fish. It is one of the most dangerous deep-sea predators that devours everything in its path. The Bathysaurus ferox reaches 50 to 65 centimeters in length. Even the tongue of this creature has sharp fangs. The King of Herrings or the Giant Oarfish this fish can be found in the Pacific, Indian, and Atlantic Oceans. The largest individual was listed in the Guinness Book of World Records. Its length was 11 meters and its weight was 272 kilograms. It is an almost inedible fish. Even animals often refuse to eat its meat. The Viperfish It's one of the most fearsome and ruthless deep-sea predators. It lives at a depth of 2,800 meters. Its teeth resemble fangs that don't even fit in its mouth. This predator swims up to its prey at a great speed and stabs at it. The viperfish can swallow fish larger than themselves thanks to its expanding stomach. It has a luminous bait on the end of its spine, which makes it easy to catch its prey. The Giant Siphonophore this creature consists of a large colony of organisms called zooids. If you lift the siphonophore to the surface, its body will disintegrate because its skeleton is only held together by enormous pressure. That's why it is impossible to identify this creature, because the caught siphonophore looks like drops of gelatin. They reach up to half a meter in length. Uripharynx pelasinoids this fish lives a depth of up to 3,000 meters and is also called the pelican eel. Its main feature is its huge mouth, which exceeds the body size of the fish. This helps the pelican eel swallow prey larger than itself. It reaches a length of about 70 centimeters. Goblin Shark This shark can be seen at depths of up to 200 meters. Because of its specific appearance, this shark is called a goblin shark. The largest individual weighed over 200 kilograms and its body length was 3.8 meters. This shark is practically unstudied by scientists as only 40 of its individuals are known to science so far. Deep Sea Anglerfish This creature looks just like a monster from a sci-fi movie. Science knows over 200 species of sea devils that live at the bottom of the Antarctic and Atlantic Oceans. The deep-sea anglerfish lures its prey with its glowing backbone. Thanks to its large mouth, it can swallow prey twice its size. The females of the deep-sea anglerfish are larger, while the males lose their ability to digest food as they grow. Therefore, it gnaws into the female's body and becomes a sperm-spraying parasite attached to the female. Banded Piglet Squid this creature lives at a depth of 100 meters and looks quite cute. They have an almost transparent body and luminous organs called photophores, which are located under their eyes. Melanocetus johnsoni 
This creature lives at a depth of up to 4,500 meters in all oceans. The female of this fish is much larger than the male and grows up to 18 centimeters, while the male is only 3 centimeters. The Melanocetus has a luminous lure that resembles a fishing rod and helps it to hunt. The Tongue-Eating Louse A very frightening and unusual creature is a parasitic isopod. The isopod clings to the tongue of its victim, the load chain is Johnny, and sucks all the blood from its tongue. When the tongue atrophies, the isopod becomes a new tongue and feeds on the food remains of the Luchanus Johnny. This process practically doesn't cause any discomfort to the Luchanus Johnny and it continues to exist normally. Lionfish It was first spotted on the shores of Florida in the 1990s of the 20th century. These fish are a danger to other species because they eat everything around them. Lionfish have long spines that protect them from predators, although predators for them are the same lionfish which are considered cannibals. They pose a serious danger to humans because their venom can be fatal for people with heart disease or with allergic reactions. Enoplogaster cornuta this monster lives at a depth of up to 5 kilometers, and the fry swim close to the surface of the water. The adults are so different from the fry that scientists used to even consider them different species. The predatory Anoplogaster cornuta grows up to 18 centimeters in length. Giant Squid These creatures live at a depth of more than 2,000 meters and reach a length of up to 10 meters. The maximum weight known to science was 495 kilograms. The average size of such squid is 8 meters. They use their long tentacles to catch their prey. Kiwa hirsuta This crustacean creature lives at a depth of over 2 kilometers. It can be found in the Pacific Ocean. It seems that the crustacean is covered with fur because all the limbs and chests of this creature are covered with bristles. Only one specimen has been caught at a depth of 2,200 meters. Idiacanthus These fish live at a depth of up to 4 kilometers. The length of females is many times greater, reaching up to 40 centimeters, while the males reach a length of up to 7 centimeters. The female Idiacanthus are predators. They can easily cope with larger prey because their mouth and stomach can stretch. The lower jaw can extend forward and drop downward. Males of this species don't eat at all. They exist only for reproduction. Chowliotus These creatures live at depths of up to 4,000 meters. They have an outgrowth with a photophore to lure their prey. They are quite similar to Idiacanthus. Their mouth and stomach can stretch, allowing them to not eat every day. Black Swallower It inhabits subtropical and tropical waters of the oceans. This creature is capable of swallowing its prey whole and much larger than itself thanks to its stretching stomach. It reaches a length of about 15 centimeters. The Giant Amoeba It is a single-celled organism and lives at a depth of over 10 kilometers. This creature reaches up to 10 centimeters in length and contains poisonous substances such as uranium, mercury, and lead. Giant amoebas filter and recycle sludge so that other organisms can exist at the bottom. Bluntnose Sixgill Shark This fish is often called the cow shark because of its large build. It reaches up to 5 meters in length. It descends to depths of up to 2,500 meters and rises to the surface at night in search of prey. It can feed on crabs, rays, seals, and other sharks. Tardigrades These invertebrate creatures are very hardy. They easily adapt to any conditions such as the bottom of the ocean, ice, or hot springs. Tardigrades survive even after exposure to radiation, ultraviolet light, and even in outer space. All this is possible because tardigrades can go into anabiosis and remove water from their bodies. Their size decreases and their body covers itself with a waxy coating. Vampire Squid This deep-sea dweller 
feels quite comfortable at a depth of over 3 kilometers. This squid has retained a resemblance to its ancestors, who lived over 300 million years ago. Giant Tube Worms These invertebrate creatures live at the bottom of the ocean with high hydrogen sulfide levels. They like low temperatures and complete darkness. Tiburonia granrojo This creature belongs to the family Almeridae. These creatures are characterized by their large size, as large as 1 meter in length. The jellyfish use its pale red tentacles to catch prey. Stargazer These terrifying-looking creatures are also very dangerous. They have two poisonous spines, with which they strike their prey suddenly emerging from the sand. These fish are electric, so an encounter with them can end very badly. Pelican eel or gulper eel This deep-sea creature is rarely seen by humans. The pelican eel looks quite strange and is capable of swallowing prey much larger than itself. The giant shark or megamata shark It is extremely rare to see this shark. It was discovered in 1976. The main feature of this fish is a huge mouth allowing it to easily swallow small fish and plankton. Chimera. These fish are also called ghost sharks. They can be found at a depth of 2,500 meters. Now science knows 50 species of chimeras. They have poisonous spines for protection. Chimeras eat mostly echinoderms and clams, other fish, or even their own relatives. As you can see, the deep sea world is very diverse, sometimes even frightening and fantastic. A huge number of creatures, from harmless to the most dangerous, that live at great depths. This underwater world remains poorly explored due to the impossibility of man to go so easily to the great depths. Let's hope that modern technology and the latest developments of scientists will soon make it possible to better explore this amazing deep-sea world.